Here's a breakdown of how you can fill any PDF using LLMs on Agent Hub. So I'm going to go ahead and make a new automation and drag in our AI fill PDF node. This node expects two inputs. One is the PDF itself, and the other is general background information that the AI will need to fill that PDF. So if I go ahead and pick a form here, like blank PDF, which I have pre-uploaded, this is what it looks like. It's expecting branch number, branch name, all of this background info. And then I provide it with any sort of background information about the, the values I want put into the PDF. I'll paste this in here. This has stuff like my name, uh, all, all the fields basically in an unstructured format. If I were to hit uh, choose the model I want filling the fields, I'll choose GPT-4 and I'll hit run. It's going to scan the PDF page by page, determine the context of the entire document, and then using this background information, we'll fill each field one at a time. Okay, it's done. We'll hit download and open it up. And it has all of my information pretty much perfectly filled out. Um, the better background info you, info you give it, the more accurately it'll, it'll fill out the doc. But it can handle any arbitrary length of PDF. If you have a 100-page document, it will treat it exactly the same. You can also load information via much more interesting sources. If you wanted to have all this info in a Google Doc, if you wanted to scrape a website to get that information, you even read it from your email. I mean, you can use any of these nodes. And another interesting thing is you can actually get this background information from images if you'd like. So we have an AI node here, Analyze Image. It uses GPT-4 Vision. And if, let's say you had a a screenshot or an image of a, an ID or a form, you could extract text from that image using vision and then pass it in to the AI fill PDF node. You could also read a, another PDF and fill this PDF using the contents of that previous PDF if you wanted to do that. Or you could pass in your background information. Let me save this as AI fill PDF. Um, I can pass in for example, uh, any background information that I want the automation to use via webhook. If let's say I have this certain PDF I, I want filled thousands of times a month um, and I wanted to, to have it filled from my backend, I could use webhook to do that. Or if I wanted to fill a hundred different PDFs, I could put it in list mode, which pretty much loops this operation on any number of PDFs you provide it. So even if you give it a thousand random PDFs and a bunch of information, it would be able to fill them all. Uh, that's a quick overview of how it works. If you have any questions, I will leave my email in the description of the video. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching.